My question concerns, uh, how does it feel to have this almost wrapped up? <laughs> and what's your emotions amazing. about it all? Um, I, you know, I'm, I'm just really happy. It's, it's, been a, it's been a long four months. We worked a lot of long hours. Um, so we're really excited about you know, getting to see it launch here in about a year. Um, although I will say I'm getting a little teary-eyed because a lot of our friends are starting to go. You know, these team members who came from other places and were with us for the last four months, you know, oh, I'm, I'm flying out tomorrow. Um, that's hard. It's hard to say goodbye to all your friends. It's, it's cool to have a career where you have friends all over the world, but it's also heartbreaking when you see them go, so. For those who have worked on the Orion for years, it was an emotional day. I watched it drive out of the facility and we closed the door behind it and it was, um, it was very moving. day for the Orion spacecraft. NASA is using it to return man and take the first woman to the moon. The Orion pulled out of Plum Brook to begin the 40-some mile trip to Mansfield. For a spacecraft as big as this, things could get in the way. That's why hundreds of electrical lines and traffic signals were temporarily taken down or moved so Orion could pass. And some turns were tight, but it made it. The chance to see a spacecraft roll down neighborhood streets brought out onlookers with cell phones in hand to record the moment.